Eat some breakfast. Yeah. All right, let's go ahead here and have a successful day. So today is the 18th. We're going to take care of the cows. We have $15,000. The money is adding up. Sweet. Uh, we're going to take care of the cows and the chickens, and then we're going to go to town and try to buy that cow again. And all the cows at once decided to run away. Got to run away now. Gonna run away. Stop. Damn you cows. Fuck. I'm way out of order now. Bunch of bitches. Had to go everywhere. We're gonna run around in circles. Hey, I think I got another big cow. Daddy Pro Gamer. He's, uh, big. Zenus. Or XSI. Or whatever it is. Did I already... Have I already got all of you through here? Oh, yeah, that's what I want. Both of you to be in the same spot. Oh, my life. It's an internal hell. I try so hard. Good old Tucky. He stays in his spot. He knows his place, because he's from Tucky. Alright. Taking care of my gamers. All my cows. We're going to pull a special little trick here. Be like, bam! Here's an SKS Pro Gamer tip. Then we're going to run right back in, and all the cows are going to be back where they're supposed to be. Giggity, giggity. Aw, oh, yeah. Cows in the right place, yeah. All right. Throw some milk. It does the body good. But I wouldn't know, because I sell all my milk. I never drink any. And he eats onions for breakfast. How can he pick up a girl when he eats onions for breakfast? I mean, that's just sick as hell. All right, three medium milks. That's good. I approve of that. Let's see, you're probably going to be a... No, you're a medium, too. All right. Looks like there's a pig on the front of it. Reminds me of the Minecraft pig. And this one should be a small milk. Yep, little bitty baby milk. Do you know that cows must have one baby a year to keep producing milk? I never really thought about that before, but uh, for some reason my cousin put that on a Facebook page, and I think I've even told you all that before. So, cool. Here's another fact. Cows make good food. <laughs> That's about the only two things you need to know about them. What? We can cut them up and eat them? Yeah! All right, let's do that. Um, I don't know if I told you the story of one of my professors. Well, he wasn't a professor. He was a high school teacher. And he was the French teacher, which I never took French. But I would go in there and, uh, obviously I wouldn't take French. But, uh, I would go in there and listen to his stories. And one of the stories was, is he was a ranger in the army. And they would drop him off on an island. And they left him, like, a chicken and a few other things. Well, the idea was to... I probably told this story before in an LP, but I'm going to tell it again. The idea was to keep the chicken alive by feeding it things on the island, and then that way it would produce you an egg every morning. Well, fucktard Colonel decided that it would be really cool just to have one big meal at the start of the week, and he ate, he bit the head off the chicken to kill it, and then he cooked it and ate it. And then when they got him back in the helicopter after picking him up after his week, which he made it through successfully, they said, why didn't you just eat the eggs? And he said, well, you all didn't feed me before I left and I was hungry, so I knew I had to eat before I started. So I guess it makes sense, but whatever. So I'm not sure. I think he said he ate mealworms and grub worms and all that good stuff the rest of the week when he could have been enjoying an egg for breakfast. So, I mean, if you're going to make a fire to cook a chicken, you can make a fire to cook an egg. Am I right? Yeah. Okay. Let's six and seven, and we are way over six hundred on the uh, grass meter. So I'm going to go again and try to buy this cow. It is Monday, I believe. Right? Yes, Monday, the eighteenth of fall. He's going to have a good day because somehow time will run three hours as I run to town. It's a long run. I challenge each of you gamers to go outside your front door and run to your city and tell me how many hours pass before you get there. 
and we'll see if Harvest Moon on a Super Nintendo here gets it right. Yes, 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 yes. You're a mother taking care of your animals. Good for you. You're a man. All right. I want to buy a cow, fucker. You better give me my cow. Bye. What? Fuck you. I'm going to come over here and kick your old ass. <sighs> I'm not reading any of your fucking notes. I'm going to go over here and get this pitchfork, and I'm going to fucking stab it through your throat, you motherfucking piece of shit, because you won't sell me a cow. Jesus Christ. I bet I have to have more grass planted. Oh, that's cool. Let's just make it to where he can't buy grass, and then be like, oh, sorry, you need more. Let's talk the red. Constant effort is important, you know. They say success comes from failure. They do. And babies come from sex, so you need to get down, bitch. Alright. <laughs> now that I've offended the three viewers that I have that are female, what am I kidding? There's not any. Grandpa is so strict. That's because you open your vagina too much. Excuse me, do you love kids? Oh, I love kids. I love kids too. My dream is to live with a lot of kids around me. Sweet. That's exactly what I was thinking. Yes, yes, yes. Fruits and nuts. Okay. Excellent. That's everybody I think I wanted to talk to. I think I'm missing one girl, but... Oh, well. It'll be cool. Let's see what we can do here. Obviously, I'm going to do the same thing I do every video. I'm going to get mushrooms, and I'm going to run back and forth and put these mush select mushrooms in the bin. I'm going to drink beer while doing so. And you gamers are going to sit there and be like, how can I comment on this to be funny? I'm going to put little number tags and say, oh, at 1720, you made a funny comment. At 130, 135, 136, 140, 143, you made stupid comments that made no sense, SKS. You should just end your life right now and quit LPing. Is my humor dry enough for you game? Oh, fuck. Whoops. Oh, shit. <laughs> um, that was karma. That was instant karma from the gaming gods. They're like, hey, fuck you down there. Quit your shit. So I will quit my shit. I will play the game and take this penis-shaped mushroom and put it in the bin. And I will call her a day. Wow, I really can't believe that I did that. It's like, it looks dangerous. Do we want to eat it? And that totally brings me back to the uh, joke about uh, if you get down there and a vagina looks like that, um, yeah, don't accidentally eat it. Yay, we got grass. This isn't ready, but I wanted to try it anyway. These look ready. I approve of these. These grasses are great. I'm going to have a ton of grass saved up, and they're still going to be like, Oh, you still can't have your cow. I'm sorry. 1850. Excellent. Alright, so we finished that day early. Let's grab our milk. Our milk. Let's grab our milk. That's not milk. What the fuck are you thinking, XKS? You obviously don't know what in the hell you're doing in this game. Are you excited? Yes! Let's have some rain. Does it ever rain in the fall here? No, they're trapped in a vacuum. It's just always pretty and sunshiny. Sunshiny. Yes, that's exactly how meteorologists cover it. It's sunshiny. All right, what do we have? All right, one more day, and then we'll be at the egg festival where I get to go find, well, you guessed it, gamers, eggs. And I'm sure somebody's going to be out here to remind me. Oh, looky here. The egg festival's tomorrow. I'll stop work earlier and come to the public square by three. If you have livestock, you better feed them before the festival. I'll definitely pick up the shipping goods in the box if you put them in it. Goodbye. Excellent. You do that, gamer dude gamer dude alright so let's take care of the cattle before I'm I'm an idiot just pay no attention to me gamers taking care of Bobo and daddy pro gamer alright hey we'll get to see our friend Grimmeth as he's at the uh, festival oh we got another big cow look at that woo woo 
You gotta be making breakfast in the morning. Get back in there. Who we got? We got Manlins. All right, Manlins is an adult. Giving me some milk. Yeah. Good old Tucky. You'll catch up to him someday, buddy. All right. Let's take care of the rest of our little ones. Cause all cows are important. He says that knowing that these cows, until they produce milk, are not important. Just kidding. All right. You ready for some large milk yet? No, you're not. Still medium. I want large milk. I want to be making over 3,000 gold a day just by you sitting there. By cows alone. By the power of Grayskull. Give me milk. All right. More medium. So three medium milks. That's pretty good mon money right now. We'll actually have a little extra income today because we're having one more cow with uh, milk. Oh, we have four medium milks. Four medium milks. Ah, ah, ah. And then we should have two small ones. I really wish I could pick up uh, more than one thing at a time. Hurts my back to run back and forth. Why do you do this to me, game? Why can't you just make it easy? Damn it. Cows. Just because you have spots doesn't mean you can just walk where you please. Buttholes. Oh lord, gamers. I got a text message earlier. I think everybody has booty calls. But this girl's becoming very, uh... Fuck! <laughs> this girl's becoming very, uh... Attached. And she's just like, Oh, I've got to go on an overnight trip. You should come with me. It's for my work. And I'm sitting here thinking, uh... No, that's just not going to happen. And and then it's like, well, why can't you? And it's just like every excuse in the book you can come up with. Uh, family issues. My kidneys failed. Um, I need to go buy beer. Oh, I'm heading north. Oh, it's going to be a big snow. I even said, well, I don't know what my family's doing for Christmas. And she goes, it's November 19th. And I go, oh, my bad. <laughs> yes, I'm an asshole. Forever alone. All right, so let's see here. Let's finish this up and take care of our chickens. I am going to try one more time to go buy a cow. He should let me have my cow because I I think I'm I'm almost up to 700 pieces. Come on, I don't need to grow anymore. It's ridiculous, and I'm sure one of you gamers are going to send some frequently asked questions stating, "Oh, well, SKS, you have to have like 64 plots of grass." If you want to have that twelfth cow, um, it's impossible, even with the number of chickens you have, because if you do the calculations and the algebraic formula, and you may use the Pythagorean theorem, that you don't have enough fodder to feed all these animals at this present moment. So you must plant, you must construct additional grass squares. I mean, shit. I mean, oh, okay. Well, thank you for that, Mr. Uh, I have too much free time on my hands. I don't just watch your LPs. I create your LPs. Yay. Good for you. You win an award. You get the golden schlong. Man, I am being very snarky tonight. Gamers, I apologize for that. No, I don't. You deserve it. Every bit of it. Just ha 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 ha. Alright, so let's run to town. Mr. British Gamer staring at his fence post again. I really think I need to get him checked out. Doo -doo -doo. I know you all love my songs. I want to buy a cow. Now listen, dude. I know we've got a past. I've bought 11 beautiful cows off of you. And I'm really buying calves, not cows. So you're really charging me for something that, you know... It should be a little bit cheaper because there's no guarantee that those cows are going to live. Now, I'm going to hit this button saying buy a cow. And you're going to let me buy this cow, or you're going to get what's coming to you. Or I can hit the wrong button and cancel the whole menu and look like a dumbass. I'm a dumbass. Yes, 5000 I want to buy it. What? I hate him. I want to get this needle and jab it right through his fucking temple. Just have some medicine, bitch. God bless. Really? So obviously I'm not going to be able to buy a cow until spring. And that's just stupid. 
Let's go get some poisonous mushrooms and try not to eat them this time. God bless. It's times like this that you just wonder, I'm blessed in life, but then God sends video games down here for you to play that just agitate you, just so he can be like, ha ha, got you there, SKS. I know you like entertaining your fans on your little LP thing that you do down there on the common land, but uh, up here, yeah, I could stop that real quick. <sighs> Speaking of, I have to do a thing for first priority at my school where the students were asked to find, they have to give a little speech on the First Amendment uh, freedom of religion, and they asked them which teacher would rant the most and get everybody fired up, and of course, like three students elected me that were there, and then I have like two teachers come and be like, hey, Mr. SKS, you like to rant, you like to tell people they're wrong to their face, how about you come to first priority and you give a speech? So guess who's going to be getting up early tomorrow to prepare a speech for first priority? That's right, I am. And I have to keep it clean, obviously, but uh, we'll see how it goes. But we've made it to Flower Day. Yay! Or not Flower Day. Fuck, that was the last festival. We're at the Egg Festival, bitches. Where I'm going to go Easter egg hunting. All right, let's see. I bet it's on TV. They're going to talk about it. They're going to be like, tomorrow's the Egg Festival. Look at this. Oh, it's a turd holding a pink thing. This is information of an event. We'll have the annual Ed Festival. The weather is very good. Ladies and gentlemen, you are cordially invited to take part. Well, thank you for that. All right, let's whistle for the dog and get ready for tomorrow. All right, so let's get ready for the, the Egg Festival. I'm so excited for the Egg Festival. Let's go take care of our cows and our chickens, and we'll cut all the grass tomorrow. Because, you know, after the event, you have to... Oh, we got another big cow! Yeah! All right. I am excited about this. Taking care of the cows. One cow at a time. I think I just got you, but whatever. Get back down there. Get over there. Quit fucking with me. I just imagine a real farmer going out there and talking to his cows and being like, Hey, get over there. Fuck you. Fuck you, cow. Get over there. Bitch. Stop. There you go. Good cow. Give me some milk. I don't know if I got him there or not. There we go. I guess I didn't. Tricky, tricky animals these cows are. Gotta make sure you push them here so you can see them. Pin them up against the rail. Just like dates, they like to be pinned up. Ha ha ha, he made a perverted joke. Do you all understand his perverted joke? If you don't, you need to go on a date with a hooker. They love being pinned up. Larry, I hate you. Welcome to the Big Cow Club. We will take your incy bincy little baby milk. But don't worry, you'll catch up to the big guys soon enough. Oh yeah, that just looked terrible. That just, from that behind pose, yeah, that was... Yeah, no wonder people in Kentucky who farm have a bad name. It's like, oh, this is my cow, Bessie. Oh, I luck, Bessie. Oh, Bessie. Oh, Bessie, you feel warm. Okay, I'm going to stop right there, gamers. I'm, I'm going to the edge of, you need to stop, SKS, before YouTube bans you for saying stuff. Listen to that sick fucker talking about fucking cows in Kentucky. Terrible. That's okay, because SKS is from Kentucky. He's from Tucky. Here in Tucky, my ladies, we we celebrate the Dragon Festival, and we don't cross the streams because of Confederate scum. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, well, then I don't know what to tell you. And I think I missed a cow. Oh, I've been playing this for quite some time. I'll have to cut this video in half, I bet. Post them tonight. Get a couple of likes and dislikes, and go on about my business. Though... My fans have been really good to me. They they rarely dislike anything. Uh, usually I get private messages about stuff that was stupid or things that I was wrong on. I appreciate that. I appreciate everybody that watches me. I could just sit here and just talk to you like you're nothing, but you are. Each and every one of you are something to me deep down inside. Aww. That's what I need to have the little clapping music and, you know, the, oh, SKS really cares, and then have the little star from NBC fly across the top and says, do 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 yeah, that's when you know you've got it big, is when you do your own messages about the more you should know. 
All right, let's take care of these last two cows. And what is up those cows up there? That one is cut in half. It's like, oh my God, what happened to you? Why are you standing on that other cow? That's physically imp. Oh, okay. But you gamers are like, what the fuck is he talking about now? I'm just gonna start circling things on the game, just so you know. Whoop. Oh, we have 666 pieces. That means that tonight there won't be a hurricane. That means that Lucifer will come down and destroy, destroy my farm. Hey, move it. I need these eggs for the egg festival. I don't think I need to take anything to the egg festival. We'll find out. Obviously we won't, because I'm not going to check. Because I feel like I'm prepared. As so I throw that egg into the shipping bin. Now, how does these bins here get picked up? Does that guy just walk all the way across the farm and go to each and every one of them? That seems like a little redundant. Or is it like a bank and there's a little suction thing under there that shoots the eggs to the main bin? Now, that would be cool as fuck. But you know good and well that some of those eggs would be cracked. And that would be hilarious to do in real life. Put an egg in the bank teller's thing and then shoot it to her and see what happens. It's probably some kind of federal offense. But it would still be well worth it. Uh-oh, my phone's ringing. Hold on, gamers. All right, I'm back after talking on the phone to somebody I didn't want to talk to. He was like, hi, this is Steve Brashear, and I'm running for governor of Kentucky. You should vote for me Tuesday on November the 7th or 8th or whatever date it is, because I need your vote. And I was just like, okay, this is a recording. I don't care what you're saying. So let's go to the egg festival. <laughs> That's what I told him. I said, fuck you, Steve Brashear. I'm here. Hey, what are you all doing? If Mr. British Gamer were here, he would find it very quickly. What are we finding? I hear the prize is a seed of the rare flower. Ooh. Alrighty, I'll try to win this year. Hey, kids. They say the winner will get a great prize. The great prize. Little kids need a handicap. No, you don't. Fucking cheaters. Hey, it's Grimace! If the prize is the prize juice. Yeah, that's what it is. Hey, old man. I won't be beaten by those young kids. Well, fuck you. I'm going to kick you in the back of the leg, you handicapped son of a bitch. All right, Mayor, what are we doing? It's the annual egg searching game in autumn. The rule is simple. The first person who finds the same colored egg as the one I show wins the game. May I begin now? Yes. Here we go. The first one is this. Oh, shit, it's a green egg. Oh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Green egg. Oh, I found it. Oh. Look at that shit. What do I do? Do I take it to him? Yes! That was so lucky. Yes, that's the same color. You get one point. Next is this one. Oh, it's the pink egg. Uh, oh, there's one back here at the church. In the graveyard? Who who hides an egg in the graveyard? Oh, shit. I don't know where the other ones are. Here's one. Oh, there's nothing there. Oh, no. Oh, I found it. Holy shit. Two for two, gamers. Can I? Oh, I can't get in this way? Are you serious? Hey, let's block half the exits so it takes them longer. All right. Two points. Take that, old man. Bitch. Red. Wasn't that one up here in the graveyard? It was, wasn't it? Wasn't it? Yeah? Yes. <laughs> I'm excellent at this game. Get out of the way, Grimmeth. You ain't even walking anywhere. Blue. I'm going to guess it's south since we've already got all the ones up here. Um, I don't really know where the chests are. Oh, here we go. Well, there's not one there. Is it in the old man's fence? Well, they're not even going to get these. They're not even trying. Of course I'm going to get them. Pussies. Y'all aren't even trying. Little kid didn't even try to tackle me. Real kids would try to tackle me. Mayor's over here yawning. That's the same color! Next is this one! Wait, isn't that the one I just got? Um. Shit, I don't know where it would be. Gamers, tell me where it's at! I don't remember where the other chest was at. I thought I'd picked them all. Um. What, what what a rip off! How can I win if I don't even know where the chest is? I ah. Shoot! I didn't get the last one.
That saddens me. The winner of this year's Egg Festival is Mr. SKS Heart! Yay! Look at that, gamers. Congratulations! I'll deliver the prize to your home. Now, everybody, let's do our best this year, too. Puff, puff. Puff, puff. Well, cool. Phew, it's good for a healthy body to do exercise sometime. Puff, puff. Puff, puff. You all need to say more. Phew, I just couldn't do it like I usually do. What's Grimace say? You didn't even move. Hick, shouldn't have come here. Well, you know why. Puff, puff, don't speak to me. Please, question mark. What? That was kind of weird. I want a turtle. It's on my nightstand. I know what that is. And you gamers are going to be so jelly when I tell you. We've made it to Thursday the 21st of fall. Um, this turtle, gamers, that I won as my prize. It's a prize from the Egg Festival. It's a charm to protect from disasters. They say, gamers, that protects me from hurricanes, so therefore I may not have hurricanes my second year farming. How about them apples? You know what? On something like that, I think I'm just going to end the video. I'm in a great mood. I hope you gamers enjoyed this super long episode, or maybe episodes, of Let's Play Harvest Moon on the Super Nintendo. This is SKS signing out. And I'm going to be hurricane-free. Good night, gamers.